Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Boom, boom, pow, pow. Grab my guy. Everybody just woke up from a nap. Because <sighs> now she's all rested. Producing Crab Maga. All right, let's get on the line. We're excited to be here. Shoulders back and Kia. All right, uh, let's just let's warm up with uh, some boxing. Now, when people say boxing, do you know what they mean? Is exactly right. Okay, boxing is a, a is a sport. And usually they put only big gloves that weigh about a pound, and they hit each other with that. It's pretty rough. It's pretty rough sport to do, but there's no kicking, there's no knees, there's no headbutts, there's no elbows. A lot of things that they don't have. They only use uh, their fist for striking, and you can only use the front part and maybe kind of the bottom part, and you can't even use this part over here. So it's, it's kind of an interesting sport because it's not really what you would do in self-defense. In self-defense, <coughs> I can throw any kind of strike I want. Right, Charlie? Look at Charlie with his legs crossed. He looks so, he looks so sophisticated. All right, so we're gonna have our hands up. Go ahead and get in our fighting stance, and let's just start with a little bit of movement here. Now, I want you to notice that when you look at my hands, it looks like a number 11, doesn't it? Here's a one, and here's another one. Good. So I have my elbows in. Let's see. Let's, let's, let's watch everybody's movement forward and backwards. And we see the 11, right? One, one. Good. Let's look at Bears. Oh, he's really dashing forward. We got a one and a one. Now, what if you saw me like this? Look, Bear. I'm like this. Do you, see a, do you see a number 11? No. No. So how, what's making it do that? My elbows, right? So we say, get your elbows in. So I want it to be here. And of course, what if you saw me like this? Is this okay? No. No, why? Because they're not in front of your face. Right, they're not in front of your face. They say, because you gotta look. Uh, yeah, you are really open here. Like, I can tell Bear, hey, I'm going to hit you. And if he had his hands right here, put your hands right here. And I want you to stop me before I get there. Ready? Look. <laughs> go. <laughs> it's like, get your hands up as soon as you can. There you go, good. There you go. There you go. <laughs> you, you can't. You can't. And nobody can. I couldn't do it even if Bear was doing it. You can't react that fast. So they have to be up there to begin with. Okay, all right, we're just working forward and backward dash. Just one step at a time. Boom, And just, just, just one step, one step forward, one step back. Are you doing it? Good. Now from the side, it should look like this. Your body's nice and straight. Your hands out in front of your face. Good, you guys don't have to do sideways. I was just showing that. Good. All right, so let's do this. We are gonna throw a combo, a combination of three different strikes. Well, actually, you know what? Before we do that, let's practice all of those strikes. Let's take our left hand. Everybody put your, your hand on your left elbow. So this is your left. So go, choop, 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 choop. Okay, we're gonna take this side right here. Now. I would never do this in a real fight, but right now I'm gonna put my right arm down. Okay, put this one down. All right, so it's right here, and I'm going to rotate my body, so my step number one is gonna be this. Okay, my whole body has turned, my hip is towards you, my shoulder is towards you, and I turn this over, and now you see the fist, and I bring it back, good. So let's do two steps like this. One will be out. Okay, good. Now, right now, I, yeah, there you go, good. Now to do this, I'm probably gonna have to rotate my foot a little bit. So we use the ball of the foot and go whoop, like this, okay? So one is gonna be out, good? Out, good, 
All right, go ahead and get your body scan. So my, your right leg is, your right leg is way back here. Good, because your right foot. If you were left, left-handed, left-footed, then you'll be like this. All right, everybody out here, it's out. Right arm just sitting on the side, and bring it back. Good, and out, and back, and out, and back, and out, and back. Can we go out and back in one smooth motion? Let's do it. Ready? Go. Good. Go. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Ready? Go. Good. Now remember, I want you to think of this, my fist, as having a string attached to it. So if somebody, please get in your stance. Okay. If somebody pulled a string on here, it would not make my hand go down like this, right? Like that. It would make it go pull across, like this, right? So I want this to go rather than out and like come down like a hammer fist. Not that a hammer fist is bad, but to get power in a hammer fist, I gotta come up and down, right? All right, we're gonna send this out. Full speed, all the way out and all the way back, ready? Go, oh yeah, go, good, go, 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 good, <coughs> excuse me, I'm thinking about my knuckles, that's what I want to be able to hit, right, boom, here, I don't want to be going like this, it may not, it may look very similar, but if I hit this part right here, that would hurt extra, a lot, <laughs> ready, go, Go, that's good. Now, take your left hand, hold this, and put it down by your side. This one down by your side, this hand up, good. Now we're gonna rotate this one. On one, we go all the way out. Man, the same thing. I gotta, I gotta turn on that foot and let that hip and shoulder be out there. Ready, one, good, freeze right there. Excellent, good, and two, and one. And two, keep the elbow in. Elbows out is not good. Ready, and one, and two, and one, and two. Let's do it all the way out and back in one big motion. Ready, go, rush, go, rush, go, rush. Good, both hands up. So these are our straights, elbows down. Now, let's do a quick, a uh, little test to ask the question, why should we keep our elbows in? Well, if you gotta throw a punch, do you want it to be fast or slow? Fast. Fast, right? Watch this. Okay, I want you to put your hands out like this. Now, I want you to, just like you're throwing a punch, go here, and then go here, and then go here. Go as fast as you can, ready to go. Do you feel fast? Not really. Okay, watch this. Now, take your hands and bring them in close with your elbows in. And now go back. <laughs> you feel faster that way? Yes. Yes. So, think about this. Okay, watch me. So now, if I have my elbows out and I'm throwing punches, will that be faster than elbows in? <clears throat> No, it'll be slower. That's why we want our elbows in. So, and so that they can go straight. Okay, elbows in. We're gonna throw a one, two punch. I don't really care which one you throw first, uh, but it would be nice if you threw the front leg one first. That's our number one. All right, ready? On my go. Mm, hands up, defense. Go, rest, rest. Good, remember, big rotation. Big rotation, ready, go, good, go, good, go, go, good, go, go, good, I'm gonna, if you, if you have somebody that can hold a target, that's always good, so you guys scooch back just a couple of steps, back, back, that way, good. All right, in your fighting stance, throwing straight, it's ready. Just go. <coughs> Two strikes, one side, then the other side. Go. <coughs> Good, nice, go. <coughs> Good, go. What's the 
difference between that and a hook. Now we threw two straights. Remember the two number 11s. And now we're going to throw something flat going across. We're going to throw a hook. Okay? So make sure you've got plenty of room. You can spread out so you don't hit your partner. Okay? So I want us to, I want, we're going we're gonna to start in our fighting stance. And let's start with this right hook. Elbow up like I'm holding a coffee cup. And then rotate my whole body. Drop that elbow. Bring up this one. And rotate. Good. Elbow high. Remember, nice and flat. Like you're looking at the top of a table. Ready to go. And rush. And well, so I'll call this left. Good. I want it equal with my shoulder. Okay? So I want it up here. Other hand, of course, protecting your face. So it should look like this. Rush. Elbow down. Rush. Elbow down. Rush. Elbow down. Rush. Good. Let's do it all together. Ready? Let's go to this side first. Go. Rush. And right. And left. And right. And left. And right. Now, of course, when I say left and right, I'm talking about which direction I'm punching, okay? All right. Now, can we put all four of those strikes together? So remember, the first two are straight, right? Boom, boom, and then hook, hook. Mm. So remember, the first one is the number 11, right? The second one, flat tabletop. Can we do it? Okay, let's start with this hand. Did everybody raise your left hand? Oh, the other left hand. Good. All right, ready? Go. One. Two. Hold on, let's go. Let's go. I'm sorry. Let's go at a, at a nice, easy pace. One, two, three, four on my call. Ready? This hand first. Go. One. Go. Two. Go. Three. Go. Four. Good. Let's call them out. Because this is also the number that we call this punch. If I say throw a number one punch, what would that be? That would be left hand straight. Exactly, left hand straight. Uh, if I said throw a number four punch, what would that be? A right hand hook. There we go, good. All right, let's do it. We're gonna go one, two, three, four. Ready, go, one, go. Two, go, three, and four. Whoosh, good, make sure we get in the fighting stance. Right foot back, right foot back. This foot back, this one back. There we go, good. Hey, go, one, go, two, go, three, go, four. I like it, good. Ready, go, one, go, two, go, three. Go four. Remember, 11 or flat table. One of them. Ready? Go. One. And two. And three. And four. Excellent. Good job. Uh, all right. So, uh, today we are going to learn what's called a roundhouse. Now, one of the strikes that Everly likes so much that she has gotten so good at in a very short period of time, because she first started doing a crab when, when this whole stay at home stuff started happening, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because she couldn't go to school, so we started doing crab at home, and she's actually only 12 years old. No. How old? Four. Four, and four and a half now, okay? So she can't even go to champion classes usually. But I think I'll probably let her because she's been just doing so well. All right, so she's going to show us in a fighting stance. Good. Uh, let's get the opposite fighting stance so they can see. Good. And she's going to do a stomp kick to the front. Hush. Good. And again. Hush. And again. Hush. Okay, good. Now, when would I want to throw a strike like this? When the person's right in front of me. Boom. <laughs> okay. In fact, I should do this for Bear just for fun. Here you go. Now, I'm very careful about this, so don't, don't do this to your family. Hey. <laughs> okay, so I put 
wiggle your mitt. Uh, 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 this is a good one for, for, it's like a punch, boom, but it's also can be like a push. Hey, get over there, okay? And push somebody away. Now, from your perspective, this is what that kind of strike looks like. You stay still. Boom, it goes straight and it's a stump. But sometimes I'm over here and the person's not in front of me, they're in front of me to the side. So I have to do a kick that doesn't go forward, but it goes to the side, okay? So we call that a round kick, round kick, okay? So here's what I want you, oh, here's how I want you to look at this kick. Uh, a couple of different ways. One way is I could just throw a kick just like the kind that I throw up, except I just lean that way here. Boom, okay? Boom, and I wanna just take my body because I want my body to be in a straight line. And if I go this way, you know, I'm kicking up, let's say I wanna kick her in the rib, Boom! I just kind of need to lean there, all right? So here's what we're gonna do. I want you guys to stand here, okay? Now, this, uh, I want you to take your right leg, this leg right here, and I want you to just throw a kick going straight up. Ready to go, boom, good, let it go. Try to knock this all the way to the roof. Ready to go, good. Now for these, since we're kicking a pad today, I'm going to take my foot, and not make it like it is when I walk, but I'm going to point the toe out so this is nice and flat. When it hits this, it's just like my hand hitting it here versus my fingers and toes hitting it like this, and that hurts, okay? So, uh, but you're just throwing it to the air. Let's all do it together. Ready? Go. Good. Go. Good. Let's really snap that thing up. Ready? Go. Get over there. Over here. Good. And I'm going to go 
up first. Good. So I put my foot, then my knee. Let's just do that. Ready? Go. Step and knee. Good. I want you to step with this one and then bring this knee up. So let's start with this. Look at me. Let's have this leg back. Up to the front again. Good. There you go. Good. And bring the knee up. Good. The knee up. And I'm going to pretend like there's a big box in front of me and I want to go over the top of the box. So I'm going to go here and then my second move is going to be this. Okay? This is kind of hard. This is, a, this is kind of a challenge. All right? So, here I am. Let's do, these are the two moves. Ready? Now, so watch. Up with the knee and then turn around. <laughs> and you think you can do it? Let's give it a shot. This one takes a while. Okay? Bring the knee up. Good. And turn around. Yeah. I'm, I'm, what I'm doing is I'm twisting on this foot. And I'm moving here. Okay? Good. And that's why it helps to put your foot sideways like this. Up and sideways. So that way you don't have to rotate it very much. See how your foot's facing forward? Let's go ahead and put our foot sideways like this. And now it's so much easier. Mm -hmm. Up and sideways. There we go. Good. Now that's the first movement. Up and to the side. Then I'm going to take this leg just like I snap it out when I'm down here. I'm going to snap it out from the side. Bip. Boom. Like this. Okay? So let's just practice that. Let's face this wall. Look, let's bring our leg up and then snap it out. Okay? I'm going to let this be your target right here. Uh, I should say, actually, if you want to grab a stool or something along that line, hold on one second, let me get one for them. This makes it a lot easier. I forgot to mention that when we first started. All right. So, for instance, let's say bear's my target. I'm going to put my hand right here, bring my leg up, and snap it. Bring my leg up, and snap it. <laughs> okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Good. Let's watch Everly go first. Okay. You're facing this way. Hold on here. Bring your leg up, and snap <laughs> Boop. There we go. Good. Up, and snap it. Boom. Now, you can see how your foot's like this, right? I'm going to take it now and point my toes out so that I don't hit my toes on it. Up and side. Whoop, there we go. Oh, that definitely hit your toes. All right, Bear, let's give Bear, let Bear a shot. Hand on there. Bring the leg up. And snap. Whoop. Oh, good job with the uh, open toes. Good. Uh, you're facing this way. Face this way right here. Up. And snap. Good. Up. And snap. Oh, good. Now remember, I'd like to get it at, lo at least, I don't know, like about this angle right here. At least that. But if I can, and especially if I'm holding on to something, I can be right here. Okay? We're going to do it without a pad. Now, everybody grab, get on the side. We're facing this direction here. You're over here. Yeah, this is your, or whatever. Okay. Uh, face this direction. Good. Let's get our legs up. And we'll start down here. Let's try to do five snaps without putting our foot down. Ready? Go. One. Go. Two. Go. Three. Go. Four. Go. Five. Woo. Good job. I hope you were able to do that. That was not easy. Let's face this way and do the same thing. Feel free to put your hand on something hard like this. <laughs> Ready? Leg up. This leg. Opposite that leg. 
Good. And snap. One. Snap. Two. Snap. Three. Snap. Four. Snap. Five. Oh, good job. Facing the other direction. Did you do it? All right. Good job. Ah, okay, facing this way again. Ready. Up. Snap. One. Snap. Two. Snap. Three. Snap. Four. Snap. Five. Good. Other direction. I did not do it. Good. All right. Good job. This way. Ready. Go. Up. And snap. And snap. Two. Snap. Three. You're doing the wrong foot. Snap, four, snap, five, snap, six. Excellent. Now, how can you practice this at home? Well, two ways. One, let's get these things out of the way. You can find something. Now, this will probably be too tall for Everly, but it might work okay for Bear. I can take a big... Uh, a cushion or something and pile a couple of cushions up, pile a few cushions up. Now I can be here and remember we said like a box, boom, boom, right? It's like I'm going over a box. So I'm going to take this leg, bring up the knee, and then I'm going to try to drive my kick across the front. So it looks like this, up, over, and down. I rotated so much, I did a little spin, right? That's okay, especially for now. Good, remember, take your foot and turn it that way. It'll make it easier. Up, over, and down. If you don't do the spin, that's okay too. Up, out, back, and in. Up, over, back, and in, right, you see? Like the box. You want to try it, Bear? Good. I'll let him do it on that side. I'll do it over here. Good. Give yourself plenty of room. I bring the knee up. Good. And down. Up. And down. And I'll give him a little target over here to give him something to shoot for. Good. So go up and then kick this straight across. Boom. Good. Now you see that there's a tendency to stay back here while your leg's here. You have to turn your body, okay? So you'll be, you'll be facing that way. Look at me, watch me. Up, whoop, I'm facing that way, aren't I? Boom, as I kick. Ready, you go. Oop, there you go, good. Good, so let your body turn to the side, okay? Ready, go. Boom, good, that's a good start. These are not easy. Oh, yeah, I like that. Now, this is where it gets challenging. <laughs> this is where they will like to see it. In fact, Everly's in a perfect place. So I'm going to hold this here like a football, okay? And I'm going to see if Bear can kick this that way and get Everly. Get her. <laughs> Almost. Let's see if he can do it. Ready, go. Oh, you are so lucky. You're so lucky. Uh, go. Oh. Okay, let me see if I can do it. All right? Here, you stay there and hold it right there. You think I can do it? Oh, it was still low, wasn't it? Let me try again. <laughs> I got her. Yay. Okay, you want to try? Here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let Everly try to hit Bear, but not up there. He's going to be on the floor. Okay? And I'm going to use a couple of pillows to make this a little bit easier for her. Okay, you're over here. Let's get one more pillow, and let's see if this works. All right. So she has to go up and over and kick this. That direction. Ready? Go. Oh, that was close. Good. Got to work on your power, don't you? How do you get power? Snapping the leg and turning the hip. Ready? Let's get
kitty. Go. Ah. Oh, she almost got him. Even if it went on the ground. Okay, here we go. Go. Ah. Oh, that was a good one. Try again. All right, so I hope you're throwing kicks over some pillows every time like this as well. Rah, good. All right. I believe she's going to get him this time. Ready, go. Ah, yeah. Excellent. Good. All right. Let's finish off with just some balance drills that will help us to throw these. Okay? All right. Let's start. Let's face this direction here, okay? And before we let our hands hold on to something, but we're not gonna do that now, just so that we can work on our balance. The better balance you have, the easier this will be. Okay, good. Everybody with your right leg up, and hold it. And one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10, you did it all the way, good. All right, let's face this way. Left leg up, ready, and go. And one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10. Were you able to, were you able to stay up till 10? Okay, this time, <laughs> this time, you try to stay up, and I'm just going to try to, I'm going to try to mess with your mind. Good. Get your leg up. Ready? For 10. Ready? Go. One. <laughs> oh, that was so easy. Did you fall down? All right. I, I'm not going to touch you, so I'm going to tell you right now. I'm not going to touch you, obviously, through the, through the camera, but let's see if you can go. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. Ready, go. Ah, one, two, three, four, five. All right. Let me show them how it's done. You try. Now, you can't touch me, but you can scare me or whatever you want. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hey, you're touching me for now. Nine. Ten. Now that's even a better challenge. Better, bigger challenge is to let them try to push you down and see if you can keep your balance. Ready? Go. One. You can push me now. Two. Three. Ooh, four. Ooh, five. Ooh, six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. I did it. Let's see if Bear can do it. Hey. One. Two, three, four. It's kind of hard. Okay, hold on. Let's see if Bear can do it with with only Everly scaring him, but you can't really touch him. Okay, you stand right here. You can do anything, but you can't touch him. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He might make it, eh? Not yet. Ah. He can't touch you, so you don't have to worry about it. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. That was really good, though. I bet you could have made it, but you just got to lean over to the side. Excellent job, guys. Okay, so round kick. Again, let's have Bear be right here. Stand right here. I'm holding this here. Uh, wait one second, we're almost finished. I'm gonna show them what a real round kick looks like. Oh no, there's a bad guy! Boom! <laughs> yeah, you wanna try it? Yeah. Okay, get over here. One more for every. Oh, I'm not talking about kicking. I'm talking about you holding this, baby. Okay. Ready! Huh, bad guy! <laughs> yeah! Remember, be very careful with whatever kind of games you play. On the line, guys. Round kicks. 
Very important kick we have to learn how to do. Shoulders back and keep it on. See ya. Everybody has to go to the restroom.